Red wine has been a popular alcoholic beverage for centuries and has been associated with several health benefits. One such benefit is its potential role in preventing and managing diabetes. In this video, we will explore the relationship between red wine and diabetes, examining the scientific evidence and studies that have been conducted on this topic. Red wine contains powerful plant compounds and antioxidants, including resveratrol. Grapes are rich in many antioxidants. These include resveratrol, catechin, epicatechin, and proanthocyanidins. These antioxidants, especially resveratrol, and proanthocyanidins, are believed to be responsible for the health benefits of red wine. Proanthocyanidins may reduce oxidative damage in the body. They may also help prevent heart disease and cancer. Resveratrol is found in grape skin. It is produced in some plants, as a response to damage or injury. This antioxidant has been linked with many health benefits, including fighting inflammation and blood clotting, as well as reducing the risk of heart disease and cancer. Resveratrol can also make test animals live longer. However, the resveratrol content of red wine is rather low. You would have to consume several bottles per day to reach the amount used in the animal studies. This is not recommended, for obvious reasons. If you're drinking wine just for the resveratrol content, then getting it from a supplement may be a better idea. Research studies. Studies have shown that red wine may have a protective effect against the development of type 2 diabetes. This is because red wine contains several bioactive compounds, including polyphenols, resveratrol, and quercetin, which have been shown to have anti-inflammatory, antioxidant, and anti-diabetic properties. A study published in the Journal of Agricultural and Food Chemistry found that the polyphenols in red wine can inhibit the activity of alpha-glucosidase, an enzyme that breaks down carbohydrates into glucose. This slows down the absorption of glucose into the bloodstream, leading to lower blood sugar levels. Another study published in the American Journal of Clinical Nutrition found that consuming red wine with a meal high in carbohydrates can significantly reduce post-meal blood sugar levels in type 2 diabetic patients. Resveratrol, a polyphenol found in red wine, has also been shown to have anti-diabetic effects. A study published in the Journal of Biological Chemistry found that resveratrol can activate a protein called SIRT1, which plays a role in regulating glucose metabolism and insulin sensitivity. This can help to prevent the development of insulin resistance, a key factor in the development of type 2 diabetes. However, it is important to note that excessive alcohol consumption, including red wine, can have negative health effects and increase the risk of developing several chronic diseases, including diabetes. The American Diabetes Association recommends that individuals with diabetes limit their alcohol intake to one drink per day for women and two drinks per day for men. How Red Wine Affects Blood Sugar According to the American Diabetes Association, drinking red wine, or any alcoholic beverage, can lower blood sugar for up to 24 hours. Because of this, they recommend checking your blood sugar before you drink, while you drink, and monitoring it for up to 24 hours after drinking. Intoxication and low blood sugar can share many of the same symptoms, so failing to check your blood glucose could cause others to assume you're feeling the effects of an alcoholic beverage when in reality your blood sugar may be reaching dangerously low levels. There's another reason to be mindful of your blood sugar levels while drinking. Some alcoholic beverages, including drinks that use juice or a mixer high in sugar, can increase blood sugar. Benefits of red wine for people with diabetes. Effects on blood sugar aside, there is some evidence that red wine might provide benefits to people with type 2 diabetes. A recent study revealed that moderate red wine consumption, defined as one glass per day in this study, can reduce the risks of heart disease in people with well-controlled type 2 diabetes. In the study, more than 200 participants were monitored for two years. One group had a glass of red wine each night with dinner, one had white wine, and the other had mineral water. All followed a healthy Mediterranean-style diet without any calorie restrictions. After two years, the red wine group had higher levels of high-density lipoprotein, HDL, or good cholesterol, than they did before, and lower cholesterol levels overall. They also saw benefits in glycemic control. The researchers concluded that drinking moderate amounts of red wine in conjunction with a healthy diet can modestly decrease heart disease risks. Older studies also reveal associations between moderate red wine intake and health benefits among type 2 diabetics, whether well controlled or not. Benefits included improved post-meal blood sugar levels, better next morning fasting blood sugar levels, and improved insulin resistance. Gut Health A 2018 study reported that red wine and grape polyphenols might improve gut microbiota, contributing to a healthy gut. 
This is because red wine polyphenols may also act trusted source as prebiotics, which are compounds that boost healthy gut bacteria. However, the research is limited, and doctors need more evidence before understanding the true effects of red wine on gut health. It boosts memory and cognitive functioning. Red wine is rich in polyphenols, which are antioxidants that help the body fight off disease, among other benefits. Resveratrol, a type of polyphenol found in red wine, may also help improve short-term memory. Recent studies show that resveratrol actually has the power to reduce damage caused by sleep deprivation, like memory deficits, and can boost your ability to learn and your cognitive processing functions. Red wine promotes eye health. Red wine health benefits go even further, thanks to resveratrol once again. With vascular enhancing properties, red wine may improve microcirculation in the eye. This process can help prevent eye-related issues such as age-related macular degeneration, diabetic retinopathy, and glaucoma, all of which contribute to vision loss. It maintains dental health. Emerging studies show that red wine may keep your mouth healthy. New data suggests red wine, specifically those beneficial polyphenols we've talked about so much, can actually fight off harmful bacteria in the mouth, which can contribute to tooth decay and gum disease. By preventing the bacteria from sticking to teeth and gums, red wine essentially stops it from causing things like cavities or plaque. Red wine can cut cancer risk. Recent studies are emerging that point to red wine as potentially having the ability to reduce cancer risk by preventing the growth of cancerous cells, particularly those associated with breast cancer and esophageal cancer. Seven. That's because resveratrol, a polyphenol in grape skin can actually kill cancer cells, according to cancer researchers. Red wine helps fight off viruses. Keeping our immune system strong against viruses is incredibly important, and red wine may have yet another promising perk in this department. One of its benefits includes immune-boosting properties, thanks to its antioxidant content. Wine contains high levels of antioxidants in the form of flavonoids, which can combat viruses. Red wine may also boost your microbiome, or healthy gut bacteria. A healthy microbiome can prevent disease development, while an unhealthy microbiome can decrease your immune function making you more susceptible to getting sick. Despite red wine being linked with some health benefits, none of them are worthy of encouraging alcohol consumption. There are many other effective ways to improve your health that don't require you to consume something that can be harmful. Red wine may have a protective effect against the development of type 2 diabetes due to its bioactive compounds, including polyphenols and resveratrol. However, it is important to consume red wine in moderation and as part of a balanced diet to reap its potential health benefits. As with any dietary change, it is important to consult with a healthcare provider before making any significant changes to your diet or lifestyle. If you enjoyed this video, kindly press the like button. Also don't forget to subscribe with notifications on, so that you don't miss out on videos like this. Thank you for watching.